Well, hello there, friends, and welcome back to my channel. My name's Renee, and I like to share the postcards that I receive from postcrossing.com. Not only do I have official postcards to share with you this week, but also round robins and direct swaps. So I got quite a few. In fact, in one day, I received all eight of my official postcards in one day. It was a really fun mailbox. But a couple of weeks ago, I had sent out a whole bunch of cards, and so I'm guessing that's why I received so many at one time. So let me share them with you. So the first card comes from Mackie in Japan, and Mackie sends me this wonderful postcard with two bottlenose dolphin. I love it so much. I love bottlenose dolphin, as you all know. <laughs> and there are the stamps. Aren't they beautiful? That's one reason why I would like to go to Japan is I would love to see, you know, like the traditional costumes. So thank you so much for that card, Mackie. The next card comes from Yvette in the Netherlands. And she sends this card. Now for November, my theme was cozy. And she says on this card <clears throat> that um, this card represents being alive with a friend, a cup of coffee or tea, with sweet little things, um, and so you could consider it coziness. And so when I responded back to her, I just mentioned that all of those things really are cozy, aren't they? Good friendships and, you know, uh, having fun over a cup of tea, gathering together, um, I, a couple of weeks ago, talked about I had watched a video, a series of videos on YouTube about living to be 100 and the blue zones and being with friends was one of them, that communication. So thank you for that card. I love it. And let me share with you all of the lovely stamps. So thank you so much for that card and for that wonderful thought. The next two cards come from Finland, and this card comes from um, Ra Raleigh. And this, of course, is the national dress of Finland. Now, this card was almost a little bit sad because Raleigh was telling me that while she dressed up um, in this clothing, that the younger generation doesn't dress up in this anymore. And so in my response back, I talked about how traditions um, are so very important and we don't often realize those traditions until after the loved one is gone, you know, um, and then, you know, we're looking at great grandma's uh, recipe that we're cooking and, you know, clothing can be the same way. So, you know, if you are of the younger generation, traditions are important. They really are. So thank you so much for this card. I love it. And there are the stamps. Can't go wrong with chocolate. <laughs> so thank you for that card. The next card comes from Timo. And let me make sure I have that up correctly. And this card is, of course, of a lake. And Timo talks about how Finland has 51,000 lakes. So plenty of work to do there. <laughs> So sorry about the glare there, um, but I love that card. So thank you, Timu. And there is the stamp. The next card comes from Canada. Now, I received two cards from Canada. And if you watched that dad guy, he said that somebody in Canada had received my address for an official postcard. Nobody has let on for these two postcards, and I'm not certain where they've come from. So let me share the first one. This one comes from Heather, and Heather is 56 and sends a postcard of a sloth. And I love sloths. They're so awesome. But Heather, and I'll just share a little bit here, has the most beautiful handwriting. Look at that. Gorgeous. And there are the stamps. So thank you for that card. And then the next card comes from Christine. Now Christine, she and I had changed, exchanged cards back and forth before 
in a, a round robin that we participated in. And so she has sent me a beluga whale, but she got my, she got my official name um, as somebody to send a postcard to. So I don't think the person is Christine. And there are the stamps. So it'll be interesting to find out. Um, these two people are, I feel are older. And so I don't think it's the two of them. So Rob, I'm still watching. <laughs> the next card comes from Germany, from Chris, Christophorus, Christophorus. And this is art. And I talked about in my response how sometimes out of tragedies um, like war, we see people who create beautiful art to try to inspire the rest of us um, to carry on. And so I wrote back a little something about that, but I loved this card and essentially what it stood for. And so let me share with you the stamps there. So thank you. And then the last official card also comes from Germany. This comes from Regina. And Regina sent me a beautiful mermaid with a whale card. And I wrote back about how much I love these animals. Um, they're just so precious and we're losing them at too fast of a rate. So thank you for that card. The next cards that I have for you, these are round robin cards. And so the first card comes from Lori and Lori is the person who makes hand makes cards. And so she made this one for Cozy. And if you see this little girl here is wearing a, a sweater and blankets and absolutely cozy. The next card comes from Gary. And Gary sent me a recipe for Cousin Lita's banana chutney. And this was in the cookbook for called Aunt Bee's Mayberry Cookbook. I love um, recipe cards. So thank you for that card. Carol sends the next card. And it's also for cozy theme. And she says that this woman has on a lovely shawl out on the water. Beautiful, beautiful card. The next card comes from Erin, and it is a whale's tail. <laughs> Love that. The next card comes from Sarah, and Sarah sent me a wonderful card. Uh, Welcome to Paradise with a wonderful seahorse on it. The next card comes from Allison, and Allison sends a Let's Be Mermaids. But I want to show you the back of this card. Make sure nothing of Allison's is showing. But look how lovely she decorated the back of this card. It's great. Thank you so much, Allison. The next card also comes from a different Allison. There were two Allisons in our round robin this month. And this, of course, is for the cozy theme. Let's see if I can reduce down my brightness there to make it so you don't get a lot of glare. Love that for the coziness theme. Barbara sends the next card, and this is for Savannah Crab Cakes. I love crab cakes. The next card comes from James, and James sends a card of Diana and Charles. This, of course, is an iconic uh, photograph of the two of them walking along the River Dee. The next card comes from Sarah. Yes, there were also two Sarahs. We had two Sarahs and two Allisons in the round robin this month. And this is a Pacific white-sided dolphin. I've often heard of them just called common dolphin, and so that's the name that I knew. But love that. And then the last um, round robin card comes from Rhonda. And Rhonda sent me a card with the Inge look grannies on it. Don't they look like they're having a blast? I just love it. Look at all cozy with their little socks and their blankets, reading, having a good laugh. Good friends are a treasure. 
The next set of cards comes from um, Direct Swaps. The first card that I received came from Jilly B, and she sent me a maxi card with Paddington the Bear. And Jilly is a part of the Unicorn Gang, and so she included a unicorn right there on it. So thank you, Jilly. I love that card. The next card, oh, and Jilly's channel is linked down below. The next card comes from Samara. Samara's channel is linked down below. Samara sent me a World Postcard Day uh, meetup card. And lots of wonderful people at that event. The next card comes from Rob. Rob's channel is linked down below. He sends me this card of a dragon turtle. No, I have never seen a dragon turtle on any of my adventures. I don't think I want to see a dragon turtle <laughs> on any of my adventures. And Rob is also a part of the unicorn gang, so there's the unicorn. The next card comes from Lewis, who sends me a card that is spooky, spooky <laughs> for Vinos y Tapas in Madrid. And if you take a look at that skull, notice that it is people. Isn't that cool? And Lewis always decorates the back of his card so beautifully. So thank you, Lewis. The next card comes from Blue, and Blue sent me a Halloween card. Love that. And then one of my students, uh, she was my graduate student, and she has uh, graduated. She graduated in um, the spring, at the end of spring. I'm so proud of her. She's working now. She's got a pretty good job and everything. Anyway, she sent me a card, and she's like, let's have lunch, because she's still living in the same area. And so, yeah. So she handmade this card for me, hand-colored it. So thank you for that card. And then the last thing that I have to share came from Stationary Panda. Her channel is linked down below. She made this wonderful envelope for me using stencils. I love this so much. And then she included a Halloween postcard. Look at that shiny gold. I love that. She also sent me, um, I like... Uh, postcards that are made out of um, the packaging on fruit products. And so she sent me this for pancakes. And she said that the pancakes there are savory and not sweet like American pancakes. And they're also very thin. And then she also sent me a little extra note here. So thank you for that. I really appreciate it, Panda. Um, I was such a joy to receive it in the mail. So that was all my cards for this week and all my exchanges and everything. I hope you've enjoyed it. So until I see you again, please stay safe and healthy. If you've not gotten your COVID booster, get out there, get your COVID booster. I got mine yesterday. Everything's fine. My arm's a little sore, but other than that, everything's fine. I didn't, you know, get any bad effects from it or anything. So please, please, I like you all so much. Get out there, get your COVID boosters. Knock on wood but I have still not had COVID. Please don't let me get COVID. I hope I haven't jinxed myself. But anyway, stay safe and healthy, and I'll see you again soon. Have a happy post-crossing day. Bye for now.